y'all and welcome back to my channel Kendall's Corner I really want a steak but I'm not cooking one on the grill it's too hot so I decided to do what I do best seafood boil so I have some boiled eggs, I have some shrimp, I have sausage, I have crawfish, I have mussels, um, corn, uh, no potatoes in this one. And then of course I have my beloved sauce. <sighs> and y'all know what that is right there. It needs no introduction. But anyway, I was just stopping through. I'm trying to get different angles, y'all. Until I see which one does best. So, <clears throat> I think I'm going to be in. My son's got to work. And I really got some work I need to do around here. But, if anybody want to drop a chick off a ribeye off the grill, you're more than welcome to. I stopped by the store this evening when I got home. I went and got me a 12 pack. <laughs> and my famous uh, sangria, Capriccio. I said, that'll last me till next week. But I said, I might not want to go back out in this heat. That's how lazy I am. <clears throat> so I don't see what nobody really want to do out there in the heat. It's just too hot. Like I said, unless it's something dealing with some water. Mm -mm. Nope. Not the kid. I'm pushing hard, y'all. I'm pushing hard. I'm trying to get these hundred subs up there. I feel like a queen doing that. But I'm close. I'm close. And I'm only close because of y'all. So thank you. If I ain't told you already, thank you. Look at that. A mess. <clears throat> Pretty much what I'm doing is I'm just trying to connect with people, especially people that um, have a story to tell or um, <clears throat> have, have something that they're doing, business, whatever. Or just chat, have some chat time with me. Um, so I'm giving these people the option of picking what they want me to cook um, because I pretty much think I can cook almost anything. Even <laughs> you know, just a little bit. Um, so <clears throat> I'm excited to be able to sit and talk. Um, Like I said, I guess collab with others. My way of networking. <clears throat> so, I got a few people that I have lined up, hopefully. And they should be some really enjoyable shows. I'm excited of what's to come.
And hopefully y'all will too. I'm actually going to be making some jerk chicken, mac and cheese, a collard greens, and cornbread for one of my booze. That will be coming soon. <clears throat> That's going to be good. I haven't made jerk chicken in a while. Uh -oh. That's good. What do you all want to see? Do y'all want to see some challenges? Like I'm about to do the hot sauce challenge. Is it certain meals you'd like me to cook? Um, I am going to do a tutorial on how I do my seafood boils. And um, me doing a replica of Beloved sauce. Um... But what do y'all want to see? What do y'all want to talk about? I'm definitely going to be doing some story times with y'all. <clears throat> but I have to really sit and think, what stories, excuse me, are appropriate? <laughs> but uh, I want to hear from y'all too. Leave in the comments below, like, is it something specific? <clears throat> y'all want to see me do, eat. Well, hold on. Let me rephrase that. For the weirdos in the world. Something that you would like me to eat, like edible food or do that's not weird. Leave that in the comments. <laughs> you know, you got to be kind of specific nowadays. Or my inbox, comment box might be jumping. Oh, my God. While I'm on that subject. For any of my people that do follow me on um, Instagram or Facebook, especially my new followers, because I've gotten a lot here lately. I don't know if it's a glitch in the system or something, but I don't really think I'm that important, but I got a lot of them. <clears throat> and I can't respond to all of them. Mm-mm. Ain't even going to sit here and try. Thank you so much for reaching out to say hello or whatever it is. I can't even read them all. Um, but between my day at work and then coming home and then doing things that I need to do for my YouTube page now. Um, and just life in general, cleaning up my house, taking some me time. Dude, I can't do it. So, um... Just right now, don't charge it to my heart. Just charge it that that shit is busy. Okay, very busy. Now, I will tell you right off the bat. If you really are being genuine, don't come at me in my inbox with no play line. <laughs> okay? Uh-uh. Think of something original. Whatever. Okay? <clears throat> I'm 47. I didn't get called everything. But some of y'all be saying some weird shit. <laughs> Ain't gonna happen, Captain. Mm. It's cancer season, y'all. My cousin Kira, her birthday. Oh my God, I forgot the date. Kira, if you're watching, don't kill me. <clears throat> but um, she, she gonna be in, in Jamaica getting it up. No, she's gonna have a blast. Because I think she's going with like some other cousins of mine, these are cousins that, like, I've never seen. And if I have seen them, it was when we were very young. Um, 
So it's like a whole piece of my puzzle that I have to go see. But we talk, but we just, you know, just never had that. You know how some times family members kind of go astray and things like that. So I got family pretty much everywhere. And like I said, I've got family that I've never seen. And of course, as I guess always we do. Um, but I've got to make my way back up north. And y'all know normally I'm going to DMV. That's it. D.C., Virginia, Maryland. But um, I have more family up in Dover and uh, Delaware, um, New Jersey, different areas, Newark, <clears throat> Plainfield probably. <clears throat> so I have a lot of family that I really got to connect with. Got to. <clears throat> because <clears throat> it's kind of for my sons it's kind of like it's small because my sisters, well, my younger sisters, all their kids are small, you know, and so my boys don't necessarily want to do what their kids want to do, and then there's more girls up that way, um, but in Charlotte, where they live, and, um, and then my brother and sister in Maryland, and then my older sister, who's in Mrs., excuse me, Tennessee, um, she's got six, but they're all there, you know what I'm saying, and though my family is rich in love, <laughs> We ain't rich in them dollars, okay? We makes it. <laughs> so, it's just not easy for everybody to take off and, and go like I want to. And I really want to see my older sister so bad. So, my plan is, though, first extra dollars I get, I'm going to make a trip down there. I got to go see her. I got to go see my nieces and nephews. Oh my God, I think I mentioned it before. I have a ball following my nephew, um, Ron Reviews, on YouTube. As well as social sites. I think they might be both the same. Sneaker head, let me tell you, he is entertaining. <laughs> and I know that's my nephew because we don't play. <sighs> but anyway, I love watching him. So YouTube has kind of brought us together as far as interacting. So... <clears throat> You know, I always try, I've, I haven't always been probably the best aunt, and it's just because life, you know. I've seen a lot of posts, you know, about people struggling with depression and things like that. Well, I did, sure did, for a long time off and on. And to this day, I still can, but I've learned um, what my triggers are, um, I've learned to attempt now because I don't always do it right, but you know, attempt to real remember that this is just for the moment, just for the moment. I go back to prayer, you know, and so it's hard. So my heart is, you know, heavy for people that suffer because I know. I don't think a lot of my family and friends even realize the extent that I dealt with it. Um, but, you know, you learn. You get older, you get wiser, and like I said, I know my triggers. So I try to stay away from them triggers. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so, you know, hey, I'd love to. Anybody out there in my local area want to come talk? I would love to have a conversation um, with someone else that's willing to divulge that information um, to my subscribers um, and talk about depression. I think that's the best thing to do is to talk about it, accept it, and understand it. It's when you try to hide it that it brings out the worst. Now, mind you, I'm not no doctor. Not no doctor at all. I probably drink too many beers to be a doctor. But I would definitely like to talk to somebody about it. You know, that we'll have a conversation. Um, and you never know. A conversation could help somebody. And that's all we'd like to do. Or all I'd like to do. <clears throat> now, see, I done gone all off on that. And I forgot why I even went there once again. I'm telling y'all. Lord, I rebuke. 
I rebuke all homicides and dementia right now from my mind. <laughs> I ain't even playing. I ain't even playing. I just get off track sometimes and I get talk and I think it's because I don't know if this is actually an Aquarian because I do like the zodiacs. Now I, I believe in them zodiacs. Um so I don't know if it's an Aquarian thing or what, but I had so many thoughts going through my mind. Like, it's 20 million things that my mind, even while I'm talking with y'all, I'll get like, ooh, I got to do this. That's what I'm thinking about. And <clears throat> sometimes it's hard to slow it down. Like, oh, my God. And so it's so many thoughts. And then it's like certain things I have to spit out right then or else I know I may forget it. Like, it's crazy. Like, do I need Jinkoba? What is that? Jinkoba? Jinkoba? I don't know. But it's something, ain't it? Y'all leave it in the comments. Because I can't be doing YouTube if I'm going to be forgetting stuff. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <clears throat> this one's for you, Paula. She hates these things. I've been told twice that I need to go live. And I guess I do. I probably should go live. Um, we'll see. I don't know. But y'all, I, I ain't going to keep complaining, though. Because I would much rather... Have the hot over the cold. For sure, for sure. Mm -mm. Nope. I ain't no cold weather fan right here. No, sir. That's why I was excited. My mama bought us damn south. I ain't want to be no parts of it. Because I be cold to my bones like... I even attempt sometimes to take iron pills because I feel like it's my iron low. Like, should not be this cold? And then at my job, you know, they always keep offices <clears throat> kind of cool. So, it's always cool in there. But we have large machines and stuff like that. So, pretty sure... You need to keep it at a certain temperature. I don't know. But you learn to adjust. I keep my snuggie, a sweater, and a heating pad at work. And there have been times I've had on all three. <laughs> I did. I did. <clears throat> but like I say, you adjust. It is what it is. So I take the heat every any day. Well, let me say, because God blesses me to be able to pay the electric bill every month so I can have some AC. I might not feel that way if I ain't had no AC. Lord have mercy. Me and my girlfriend were earlier. Paula talking about I you know, feel so sorry for people that don't have air conditioning. In this type of weather. Even though you know there's some older people. And they like it hot. But I'm not that one. <clears throat> Woo y'all. I'm getting. I'm starting to get full. But half this was for my son anyway. <laughs> it just looked so pretty when it was so big and full. But I'm put a little dent in because now y'all can see this area. <laughs> Whew. Oh my God, that sausage was so good. It was smoked sausage. 
and I fried it up so it got a little dark. And then I sauteed it in B Love's sauce and sprinkled some Old Bay. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. That wants some good sauce. So good. Because normally, like, I'll eat the sausage because I like it, but I don't have to have a lot. Uh, that right there. That right there. <clears throat> mm, that's good. That's good, y'all. It's good. Anyway. So, me and my everything, my best friend, my boo, Anita. So, Anita, if you're watching, hey, baby. Um, when she used to come up here often, um, but this is before she got a fiancé, y'all. She got to spend time with her fiancé. <laughs> we, she used to come up, get a couple, bottle wine, couple bottles of wine, beer, whatever we're drinking on. And we would just lay up in the living room and watch Cat Williams all night and laugh and talk. Oh, my God. Some of the best times ever. And uh, so it just makes me think, I think I'm going to watch Cat tonight. <laughs> all that to say that. I think I want to see me some Cat. Yeah. Woo. Y'all. That's good. That's good. Mm, I do. I, you know, another thing I just thought about. See, I told y'all my mind be everywhere. I got to get, um, I want to get another mic. I don't know. How am I sounding out there? I actually, though, would love to do some of those ASMR videos. <gasps> where you hear all the crackling and all that stuff. Yes. <laughs> I'm going to look into it. But I got to get my laptop first. Whew. Y'all, I think I'm about to give up here. And I said I ain't want to be up here long anyway. Thumbs up, thumbs down. <laughs> Real quick before I go. Because I know my boo Carol from my workplace going to be watching this. Her and Donna. So like I said, whether we get thumbs up or thumbs Thumbs down. <laughs> oh, we still moving on. All right, y'all. I'm calling it quits. I'm done. I'm going to wash my hands, clean up this mess, well, and pack that up like I never touched it. My son's going to be like, oh, you were so special. No, I already ate out of it. Anyway, um, again, subscribe. Please subscribe to my channel. Give me some thumbs up if you like the videos <clears throat> as well. Leave me some comments below. Let me know what y'all think I can improve on. Let me know what y'all want me to do. Any challenges y'all want me to take. Let's intertwine up in this comment section. All right? Please? Yes? You are? Okay. I thought so. I thought so. But I love sitting with y'all. I love eating with y'all. Thank you so much to the subscribers that I currently have. Thank you for your support. Thank you for all of those, all of you that are sharing my video. I couldn't ask for nothing more. I'm just sitting here doing something that I love to do. Where it takes me, I don't know. But right now, I'm having a ball. <laughs> well... You know, on Facebook and Instagram, you can reach your girl at Kendall's Corner. On Snapchat, KenThomas72. Until the next video, be blessed. I sure am.